It's one of the Insecticons! Hmm? Yeah, could you be a nice dinner for us? Cliff Shopper, would you be nice to see what we can do to you? After 25 years, or actually almost 30 years, and you still sound like a little creepy person. That's just the boys. We are the we insecticons are love to gonna eat you. Screw it. No. Dang it, where he go? Right over here. You shoot me with a disc? Yeah, yeah. What an idiot. Hello, this is Spider Frank bringing you a video view of the tra of Transformers Fall of Cybertron Generations and Insecticon No Nets Kickback. Yes, pretty much. He's pretty much the only Insecticon. <coughs> Wait until the other two. This is pretty much great and all that. He got wings, which you can make him fly. His legs, you can actually make him jump. Got a little bug thing. Very good. And his dish launcher will do. Really. This dish launcher. You can you cannot shoot the bug. It shoots perfectly fine. And it's purple. Disc. Yeah. Pretty much straight. Now we can see pictures of beast mode and it's Yeah, try to have pic you see what I done with the pictures. Yep. To transform. Kick back to robot mode. First things first. Remove the bug rings. Then remove then flip for the legs so you can kinda clop them in robot mode into the robot mode position. Tell you these insect cons, they're pretty great. Then you open up the arm compartment, and now it looks freaky ish. And yeah, however, you can slowly see it. Then you put down the little antenna, open up the compartment, and open up the bug mode thing, unclip it to resolve the bug modes in you know, workings and you can then you we can see what comes together and rotate the robot moves feet around rotate the robot moves legs yeah combine to the race then you clip it into the robot mode, flip up the antenna, and rotate the robot modes. Not G1 homage, kick back in, open up the, the abdomen, and put the thorax of the bug mode into the shoulder blade. And on that, as for the very creepy Dr. Octopus style legs as for the other legs this you can put them right there yeah and here is kickback in robot mode yeah here is kickback in robot mode and you can see He's pretty nicely detailed, and all the bug bits he is, yeah, pretty nice. 
Look at that head scope. Does it look kickbackish? Mm, yeah, in a little bit. Yeah. As for the weapon, he is. You can have the, his cannon and his blades, and you combine them together in whatever side. They can form this thing, who looks similar to Valkama's weapon. If if I were about red or had bottles, you know what I mean. But anyway, for articulation, it can rotate 360 degrees, goes not up or down, just a little bit down. Arms have this ball joint, this arm thing has the ball joint, legs go for 360 degrees, four bend, rotate in the bicep. No way some change by the transformation. Legs go forward, they rotate, and they bend. He has a ankle pivot and a forward back motion. He is pretty much a grasshopperly goodness. For a size comparison, he is next to to a Warf Cybertron toy. Cliff jumper. And you see, yeah. He is a little bit smaller than Cliff, but hey. He's an Insecticon. What do you expect it? As he is might be the only Insecticon in this line. But kickback is pretty great and all that. And if if Hasbro decides to release a deluxe scale, hard shell and a deluxe scale sharp shot, then we'll be alright. But as for right now, Kickback is the only Insecticon. And I did forget to mention the... Yes, he has rotation. Sorry to miss that point of articulation. But anyway, he is pretty nice and all that. But hey, he is great. After all, this is Fresh Prime. And if you want to follow me on any of these lovely sites, follow me at Twitter.com slash Spirish Prime 2. And if you want to see me, my DVR, follow so on my DVR page at DVR.com slash Megatron, Grimlock Megatron, or ask me a Christian at SpringForWardMe.com slash Spirish Prime. And yeah. But anyway, this is my friend Sim Tan. And next review? What the? I heard the roast! That was unexpected.